Today I'm working on a RAV4 rear quarter panel smash. The dent covers the entire height and width of the panel. I'll be using my PDR bridge with a drill and cold glue from Glexo. I will get a dent from looking like this to this. Hello my YouTube <laughs> friends, Clark Ken, the Man of Steel. Welcome back to another big dent repair. I'm going to use a new two-part method, a drill and cold glue combination. If you're a new tech, this will be a great new tip that will help you out on your paintless dent removal journey. So what I'm doing now is I'm taking some, some hot glue tabs, placing it on the body line. The goal here is to pull the body line first and hoping for the crown to be released at the same time. So I have the bridge puller in place, placing my bit into my drill. I'm taking my torch, warming up the crown. I don't want any paint cracking. Placing the drill bit in. This is great deep dent content. I am pulling the dent with the drill. The drill is doing all the work. Let's rewind that and let's take a closer look. Pow! Simultaneously the dent is lifting and the crown is going down. And finally the lower section of the dent is released. So with the remaining pressure of the puller, I am going after the crown. The toughest section of the dent is now gone. I'm doing a little more knockdown with my blending hammer tapping down the crown. I'm using light controlled hits. And let's take a closer look. The line in the body line is restored. The crown is down. That glue tab worked amazingly on that body line. So now I am removing the PDR glue tab and glue residue with the window wedge and the 91% alcohol. I'm using the super tab by Kiko. And again, the drill is doing all the work, doing all the lifting. Great for monster pulls. Now the Glexo glue. I chose this tab. There are four tabs in the Glexo kit. After I torched the, uh, the putty, I'm now going after the lows and the rem remaining low up above. And you can see there, pulled the remaining sections of the dent. Then I'm going to bounce around to different sections of the quarter panel, bring up some more lows. And you can see that quarter panel, 90% of that dent is gone. Hot glue and cold glue. This car is ripped in half. We're gonna use that quarter panel to replace another quarter panel on another vehicle. So here is the RAV4, it's parked in the garage. Now we're under different lighting. So you can see the remaining lows and highs. I will need to bring up those lows with my PDR rods. And you can see the tail light there. It's a great push angle. I am now scraping the back side of the quarter panel, removing the sound dent. I'm going to be going after the remaining lows of this huge 26 inch dent. I'm going to be manipulating the crowns with knockdown tips. I will be using my wide tips for knockdown along with my sharp tips. I will go through the panel to gently knock down the crown to smooth out the metal. With a PDR rod, I will need to be careful not to push too hard. I can create more damage. I will use my sharp tip to bring up the micro lows. I'm hoping this video was helpful in your paintless dent removal career. Here's the final pan of the panel of this rear quarter panel smash. You have a before and an after. If you like the video, it'd be great to get a thumbs up. If you want more videos like this, hit the subscribe button 
and you'll be notified. Don't forget, the subscriber that shares my video the most will win a weekend training with Clark Kim, the Man of Steel. See you in my next video.